Uh, so if we switch over to this, this is just kind of going to preemptively inform us before we look at the characters. I'm going to look at every character in uh, Honkai Star Rail right now because I'm just curious as to who they are and what they are. So destruction characters, or think of it as character classes. Destruction characters is a general DPS. Interesting to use destruction. Single target is hunt characters. Hopefully you guys can see this. Yeah, you can. Eurydation. I don't know why they had to choose a word like that. Eurydation multi-target. They could have just called it, I don't know, like a bombard or some crap. Like, I don't fucking know. Eurydation, though. Um, or erud erudation. Probably not eurydation. Erudation. Uh, multi-target. Harmony. Offensive slash utility support. Nihility. Debuffer. Per preservation. Defense to support and tank off. Uh, abundance. Healer. They chose interesting names, but you know, it makes sense in the end, right? You can probably look up the s synonyms for these words, and it prob probably comes up with... Uh, what it what it's meant to but anyway elements physical bleed deals additional damage and apply the bleed effect a physical dot bleed character burning uh, it's burning freeze the enemy preventing it from taking any actions yeah we all know the, how that works lightning lightning's usually one that shifts between how it works in most games like the shock in eversoul works completely different to shock in any other game because eversoul is just a weirdo uh deals additional light damage and apply the shock effect which is just a dot i guess damage over time wind shear is wind damage and a dot. Quantum Entanglement, classic quantum. Uh, uh, applies the entanglement effect, pushes the enemy back in the turn order and deals quantum damage. That sounds quite useful. And then Imaginary Imprisonment, applies the imprisonment effect, pushes the enemy back into the turn order and reduces the enemy's speed. So Imaginary is going to be probably the best. Because you just kind of, you go first more often. Which is kind of usually what you want. Uh, but we kind of, that was kind of to be expected, most of that stuff. Imaginary and Quantum, you probably had to try to figure it out, but the other other elements were kind of obvious. Let's have a look at the characters. Now, um, by, by Lou. Where's the art? I think, I, I don't know which ones are new, but a lot of these look cool. I'm not going to look at their kits too often. I think this character doesn't even have a kit because they're, they're literally coming out in this new beta. Uh, I'm pretty sure this character is the, one of the brand new ones. Coming out in the... In the beta in february but looks like a, a small child that's a, a shark or a whale or a serpent something along those lines element lightning abundant path is abundance now what does abundance mean again go back to the discord abundance is a healer a lightning healer five star the affiliation is with jean Lu luofu va english Oh wait, there. Wait, HSR has English uh, voiceover. Oh, it does too. Oh, I totally forgot that it does. Ah, oh, dude, I I won't have to read. Oh my god, I'll just I'll be able to just lean back and listen. Just hit it with the. Oh, just relax and listen. Oh. All right. Okay, that's cool. Uh, next one, Blade. I think this one was a pretty early character. This is definitely not new. Uh, the new ones are Bai Lu, Ch Ching Shou, Ting Yun, and uh, Yang, Sh Yang Chin. Okay, I'll take a look at... Pardon me. This guy has an actual kit because he was in the beta previously, but... I think this is like the... the, the who? The, the Zhongli, the Tartaglia of the fucking game? Looks like it. Just kind of a, a, a stoic... Oh no, it's the, it's the tall Zhao, but he's just a stoic person. Can I uh, open these images in better quality? No. No, that doesn't do, doesn't do shit. That doesn't do shit. He looks cool. What is he? A wind destruction. Generic wind DPS. Almost like he essentially is Zhao. Uh, uh, Bronya. We all know Bronya. She's wind here. Interesting. Interesting. Wait, well, she could have been ice, but I guess, you know, they got to change it up a bit. They got to make it not be a copy. You know what I mean? Uh, so Bronya. I don't see where the wind is, but, uh, you know, I definitely see a few icy things. Is this a typo? Harmony character? What does harmony mean again? Harmony means offensive slash utility support. So just a damage booster. Where, where's the damage booster? After casting ultimate increase, ally of, uh, attack of allies by 30% and crit damage of all allies by 30% as well for two turns. Oh, man, yeah, look at that. That's a pretty juicy one. Bronya is going to be the best character on launch, guaranteed. Next character, Clara. 
I think this character was quite liked uh, early on just because the uh, the mech man here. I remember this mech man here looked kind of cool when the uh, HSR was like not officially announced, but like one of the first early betas was there. He got a lot of stats. What is she? What, what role is she? The, she's a, a physical destruction, physical main DPS. Incredible early main DPS. Gepard or Gepard. An ice preservation. Preservation is a defensive tank or uh, defensive support slash tank. Very, very cool. What's it look like? I think that's a bit big of a cape there. Uh, there's Otto. Lukoa, Luko, Lukoa, Luko, Otto is wind. Is he? That's not Otto. But he's, this guy's ice preservation. Bray, Bryson Borgus. Hmm, I'm interested to see, like, exactly, like, how they sound. Because I don't know many, um... I don't know many voice actors uh, in terms of just name. So I'm, cho I'm keen to see how everyone sounds. Uh, Himiko, do do what? Himiko? What? Uh, Uridation, fire character. Whoops, I did not mean to open that. Uh, whoopsie daisy. Close that bad boy. Uh, what's Uridation again? Uridation is multi target DPS. Uh, see a court. Is that the same actor? Is that the same actor as, um. No, well, I guess Himiko doesn't have an English VA, never mind. So I don't know. But yeah, Himeko, we all know Himeko is just Himeko. She just has a massive cannon, she's fire, she's beautiful, big boongas. Uh, we all know Himeko. Uh, Jin, Jin Yuan. Infinitely terrible pronunciation. Lightning, Uridation, multi-hit target. I think this guy was quite hyped, right? Because he just looks like a badass. He's playing Shogi or some sort of Chinese uh, board game with a lion. You can't really get more badass than that. I guess if you had like maybe... um. A Rayquaza or like a Kyogre in the background as well that could kind of boost popularity. But I guess a lion is quite cool. Lightning Iridation. But it is voiced by Alejandro, who is the voice actor for um uh fucking what's his name? The lightning guy from Genshin. And he's also a VTuber. Can't remember the I can't remember the fucking Genshin character's name. Sino, that's the one, Sino. Voices uh, Sino as well. So that's pretty cool. Next one, Kafka. Lightning Nihility. What's Nihility again? Debuffer. Kafka's a bit of a weird character, I think, generally speaking. Isn't she like one of those fucking uh, uh, weirdos? Yeah, she's definitely a weirdo. I can, I can just uh, get weirdo vibes from her. But she's a big bungus woman. So we love that. Uh, English VI, I don't know. Nihility though, Lightning. Five star, incredible. Next one is... Luocha. Luocha. He's an imaginary abundance. He's an abundance of imaginary bullshit. Uh, where's his art? Come on, art. There he is. Okay. He's a... Uh, what does abundance do again? Uh, he's a healer. Uh, I guess it does look like, like Otto a bit. Uh, this guy just looks slightly happier, uh, generally speaking. And he's also a healer, which is the opposite of Otto. And he's also putting his amulet in the water. God knows what for, but he's a healer. And imaginary, so it's probably going to put him right at the top of the food chain, because imaginary is usually Frank. Seely, we all know a Seely. She's quantum, and she's a hunt, which is a, a, a single target main DPS. Uh, where's, the, where's the art? So it's like Kaching, but Seely. Uh, the end of story. Boom. Uh, Silver Wolf of the Urals, which is quantum nihility. Kind of a... Kind of interesting to have two Bronyas, essentially. Although it's, a, you know, it's going to be sacrilegious to call her Bronya because it's Silver Wolf. But having two Bronyas in your game, kind of interesting. Looks cool. What is she again? Nihility. What's that? Debuffer. Quantum debuffer. Got to put her high in the food chain as well. Trailblazer. The, I find it very interesting that the, uh, the main characters can be two different elements, from my understanding. They're like, they're, they're like, they're two different elements. Just find that to be interesting. Or is it, does it matter? The art style is different. Wait, do you play as both of them? Now nah, I'm confused. Doesn't matter. Regardless, one is uh, physical, the other one is fire. You're always going to probably go for the elemental one if you want efficiency or some shit. If I, if I, uh, if I, if I think about it, to be honest. But yeah, whatever. Just like Genshin, well, one seems to be an element, one seems the other. So there might be a tactical advantage in getting one. 
Uh, next one, Welt, Imaginary Nihility. Uh, I've already forgotten what Nihility is. It's, it's Debuffer. An Imaginary. Okay, here we go. You got Welt Yang, you got Tesla and Einstein, you got Joyce, and you got... Uh, is that... Ooh, I think that might be Otto Apocalypso. Or his mother or his father, whoever. You never know who it is. Looks cool. It's just Welt Yang, though, so... Corey Landis. Um, I'm assuming this is the same voice actor as the uh, Honkai Impact um, Welt Yang. I'm infinitely curious to to know who the uh, like who they chose as the English voice actor for some of the Honkai characters, because the same thing can be said with Bronya. Like uh, it's a Sumikana, and so you know it's gonna sound like Bronya. But I'm more interested to know who they chose as the English VA to, to see if it does it. Will it kind of feel like Bronya or does it? feel out of place i'm sure it pretty much it would feel right like with some of these characters like bronya welt and i'm pretty, pretty sure yeah kasumi uh, uh connor is there but melissa fan um i'm curious to see who it is uh avoid archives nah it's again it's, it's auto apocalypse actually it might even be a, a genshin character called zhongli you never know you never know anyway last character yan ching a new character ice hunt no information on them but it's essentially Li su shang as a male to be quite frank with you so it is what it is. Uh, but what, what was their role? Ice Hunt. Ice main DPS single target. Uh, yeah. Uh, what about Carol Spice? Who? Who? Uh, Elisa VA for who? This guy. M Marina Ino. Mar Marina and Ino. For there on launch. So Arlan, a four-star destruction character. Destruction is, in fact, a general DPS. So he's just going to be able to do AoE and single target mixture. Lightning. And I guess uh, Danny Chambers. Okay. Shiraishi, Ryoko, and Diantao. Or however it's said. Hey, uh, what is this? What am I looking at here? What am I looking at? Is that a flag wrapped around his sword? He's just a sword guy? Struggling to figure out what I'm looking at here. But they're looking at something, and it looks interesting enough. So who's next? Asta. Or Asta? However you want to say it. Asta, Asta. It's a name. Fire Harmony. Fire Offensive Utility. Incredible. Felicia Angel. Angel Akasaki Chinatsu. Or that name, which I will not even attempt. Uh, fire Offensive Utility. Kind of gives me uh, Hubble's, Hubble uh, from Neural Cloud vibes. This character looks cool. Dan Heng, the character that everyone loves. Uh, I think everyone can universally say that they like this character. Who, If you've played this game or some shit, you'd be like, oh, I love this character. Oh, he's super cool. And he's just leaning on a tree, dude. Bro, imagine just leaning on a tree. Hey, but anyway, he's a wind hunt, so wind main single target DPS. Nicholas Liang, uh, Ito Kento, and Yudong. I would read the Korean VA, but I can't read Korean. Uh, and the Astral Express, yeah, some of these characters are part of the, the, the railway. Uh, Herta, Ice Irradation or Eridation. Eridation is multi target DPS. PJ Matson, Yamasaki, Yamazaki Haruka, and Xiao Fei Huo. Incredible pronunciation by yours truly. Uh, looks cool. Ice, ice multi target DPS. What's the art style like? Oh, she's a doll. And she's got puppets of the main characters. Yeah, listen. Getting, uh, as they say, as the hip kids say, red flags. Uh, looks cool, though. Nice concept. Doll, though. Uh, like the look of it. I might even go, like, make videos about these characters slowly. Uh, I think before the launch of the game, I, I might make small analysis videos. Who knows? I might compile, like, start early and, and, uh, and analyze the game. Uh, to the best of my ability, and get early into it. Uh, anyway, next character, Hook. Uh, Felicia Angel, another voice actor who did another character in the game, and Toku, uh, Tokui Sora. I'm terrible at pronouncing. Uh, Fire Destruction, which destruction is in fact a general DPS. Looks cool, looks cool. Character design. Uh, it's essentially like Orange Klee, to be quite frank with you. Uh, just a, a, a child that deals with explosives. I don't know why my hoe has a weird obsession with children and explosives. It's kind of weird here right now, but hey, it is what it is. Uh, March 7th, the flagship character that everyone loves and cares and knows about. Bow character. They are Ice Preservation. Preservation is, is in fact defensive support tank. Bow character that is a tank. Whatever. 
Skylar Davenport, Ogura Yui, and nu Nuoya? N Nuoya? Nuoya? N I don't know how to say that, but a main character of the game. Natasha. Um, physical abundance. What's abundance? I'm forgetting everything. It's a healer. Isn't I, I think I like Natasha when I saw her. I think I like her as a character. She's just kind of like a... Isn't this like just a... What's her face? Raven? Isn't it just Raven? Like in terms of like lore, there's children in the picture. It's probably an orphanage. So it's just Raven, right? No! And instead of using a bow, she's a doctor. So, you know, slight difference there. Uh, and yeah, it is what it is. And Natasha Kiara is in fact Raven's uh, real name. Yeah, that's what I meant. I'm not sure. I'm assuming the Uchiyama Yu Yumi is, you know, same voice actor, maybe. Who knows? Our next character, Pila Pella. It's an Ice Nihility, which is debuffer. Xanth Hine. Morohoshi. Morohoshi. Samaya, Sumire, or some, something along those lines. What is it? Nihility debuffer. Uh, art, come on. There it is. Uh, what am I looking at here? What am I looking at here? Uh, she like summons guns? Hacksaw Bunny? She has floating guns around her and summons them. So it's like a, it's like a Hershey Avoid Hacksaw Bunny mix she summons guns through portals and these guns shoot enemies incredible incredible uh this is another one this is another of the new ones this was in the cinematic chinchu Ch uh, honestly terrible pronunciation again shogi oh, dude incredible what are they quantum urination so they're going to be top of the food chain because of quantum urination again is uh oh erudation multi-target dps quantum you're right what can you okay what do you want uh voice actors brune april Brian, Bryn, Arissa Date, and Liu Shishi, 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 something like that. Uh, Sampo, I think everyone loves Sampo. Everyone hates Sampo. I can't remember the uh, the general consensus of this character, but he's he's I think he's the Tartaglia now that I remember it. He's the Tartaglia. Steam has an update. Oh, cringe! But he does use an interesting weapon. He has like it's like a chain blade. If I remember correctly, it's like a it's d dual daggers or a chain blade. It's like it's something like this. I can see a chain. Uh, but he's a, a wind nihility. It looks pretty cool. Wind nihility. Wind debuffer. Um, I think most of the elements seem to be rough. Like unless there's an elemental um chain of like uh like certain things. Is is there an elemental counter triangle? Is that a thing in this game? A counter circle, whatever the fuck you want to call it. Is that is that in this game? I can't remember. I haven't read the details of much. I haven't really read anything. I haven't I haven't actually I don't know anything. Um, but is there? There is? Okay, because I was gonna say, if it comes down to the same thing as, like, Genshin, where it's just the elements are the type of damage you deal, uh, then I would have been like, it's not that important, because most of the elements deal the same thing, but if there's a triangle, I guess it's gonna be fire beats ice, ice beats lightning, lightning beats wind, and wind beats fire. I'm assuming it's gonna be that, and then these two, instead of beating each other, they beat themselves, like Honkai, I'm assuming it's gonna be like that. Uh, is it? Maybe I can, uh, actually, we'll get through the characters, and I might look it up. Serval is the next one. Serval? Servel? Is this the official or something? What am I seeing here? Stage. Is that a guitar or is that a drum? Uh, sorry, a bass guitar. It's an instrument. Looks cool. What is she? Uh, lightning AoE damage dealer. Incredible. Uh, Natalie Van Steen or Amy. Amy? Amy? Something like that. Cool. Cool, cool. Lee Su Shang is a physical this time. Not even an eye. She's a physical hunt. A single target DPS. Anjali Kunapanen. Uh, butchering. But it is what it is. Uh, Fuku and Misato and Chen Ting Ting. Okay, fair enough. Sounds good, sounds good. Lee Su Shang. We all know Su Shang, dude. We all know. We all know Su Shang. Uh, great character. And then last one. Ting Young. Ting, Ting Young. Incredible pronunciation by me. Lightning Harmony. Lightning Healer. No, not Lightning Healer. Lightning Offensive Utility. And uh, a cat. Or a fox. Or a fox. A fox. It's a fox character. <clears throat> uh, Sushang is an insane DPS. Plays around speed. I also play around with speed. <laughs> you know what I mean? No, that's a complete jest. But yeah, I think I did see when I was... What I looked at one bit of gameplay and Lee Sushang was in it. So maybe that's also a thing that's going to happen. Is that Sushang is going to be a pretty, pretty... 
incredible. So yeah, that was cool. And yeah, 